Hey guys, this is Dapson Ishmael. In today's tutorial, we are going to take a look at using the SEO Assistant to practically and Wizard Web Builder version 17. So to be able to do this, I'm going to first show you where the SEO Assistant 2 is available. So you simply go to page and then you click on SEO Assistant under 2. So when I click on this, it is going to give me some issues that I found with the pages I have for the website that I'm building. Now, to make this more practical, I'm going to open a website project that I've already designed in a different version, in version 17. So let me just come to file, then I'm going to go ahead to open this. I'm not going to save this. And yes, so I'm going to get back here and then use the SEO assistant. And this is supposed to give me information or errors with the pages that I have on this particular website. So as Part of them, one is a page doesn't have a language set as default for it. And then also the website has no robot text also. So if I double click on this, it takes me to that particular page, which doesn't have a language. So as you notice, this doesn't have any language set for it. And if this is a concern in terms of the project you are working on, looking at search engine optimization, then you can easily fix that one is that's one of the cool things about this particular SEO assistant if i close this and let's say for this particular page i want to be able to address the issue once i double click on it it is going to take me to the respective section to be able to make the necessary fixes for it so this it says it has no robot text so if i want to add robot text then i'm going to go ahead to use this um, robot um, text section to configure that aspect on my website so uh, these are some of the um, ways by which you can use the seo assistant and then finally for my master page it says enable structured data so if i come in here okay so it means i have to go to the master page and then do that from there and if i refresh if i've done all these fixes and i refresh all these the ones that has been done are supposed to go away and the ones that are yet to be done are supposed to remain now you are able to have a lot of options here so if i come to this page and probably I just cleared the um, keywords from here. I clear the description, I click on OK and I come back to my SEO assistant over here, trying to find the issues. It's, I'm sure it's going to point out to me that I don't have any description as well as keyword for this particular page. And if I double click on that, it simply brings me to this section. If I double click on this, it simply takes me to that particular section for me to be able to make um, those necessary fixes. So that is how to go about using the SEO Assistant 2 and version 17 of WYSIWYG Web Builder. This is very cool to help you know some of the things that you're supposed to do to help optimize your websites or your web pages for search engines.